Good afternoon. I'm Abraham Cambridge, founder of the Sun Exchange. Solar energy finance for a developing world. Through the Sun Exchange, you can own and earn from solar panels powering Africa. In 2014, I moved to South Africa to advise banks investing into utility scale solar plants. When I got there, I realized there was very few solar panels on the roofs of the industrial facilities and on the communities that are the foundation of the African economy. Which is absurd, because Africa is the sunniest continent on Earth, and there's 650 million people without electricity. The population is increasing at such a rate that it's going to reach 5.6 billion people by the year 2100. So the question is, from where are they going to get energy? Well, the quickest, simplest, and cheapest way of doing this is through solar power, and that creates for a remarkable investment opportunity. We enable anyone, anywhere, to invest in solar panels. This means that if you're living in an apartment in New York City and you want to invest in solar panels, you now can and have them installed, operating, and maintained in the sunniest location on Earth. But doing business to Africa is risky continent rife with corruption, and these projects are going to be running for decades. To enable secure investment into Africa, we are building a blockchain smart contract which distributes solar energy revenue in real time by the kilowatt hour. We are literally streaming monetized African sunshine around the world. Doing things on the blockchain gives us two significant advantages. Firstly, it offers total transparency on the projects that we host. And secondly, it's autonomous. So the Sun Exchange needn't be around in decades to come, and you can still be confident that you're getting the returns from your solar assets. And this isn't all theory. On the first solar crowd sale campaign that we hosted, we raised $30,000 from 70 individuals from 11 countries around the world to solar power a school outside of Cape Town. In doing so, those solar panel owners are now earning a 10% annual return, and we have reduced the school's running costs. To date, we have $42 million worth of solar projects in our pipeline. These are projects that have been bought to us from solar installers from Germany, US, UK, operating in Africa. They have pre-developed projects, they just need funding. It's going to take $350 billion to electrify Africa. That may sound like a lot. But consider that to date, $3.4 trillion has been pledged into clean energy. The problem isn't lack of funds, it's the absence of a marketplace to connect investors to projects. And the Sun Exchange has closed that gap for Africa. I've been in the solar industry for 10 years, and it may not seem like a long time, but in this industry, it's an eternity. I've been a solar installer, a project developer, technical advisor, I've sat on every side of the table and played school fees along the way. Our CTO, Lisa Line, has spent 30 years developing enterprise-grade software, and our CFO, Larry Temlock, has spent the last 20 years working the capital markets of the developing world. But it's not just the team that's special. The Sun Exchange is doing things that no one has done before in places that people have dared to tread. We are the only clean energy crowdfunding company servicing Southern Africa. The Sun Exchange won Best Blockchain Company in Africa Award at the African FinTech Awards, and we've been featured in no less than 20 industry publications in the past six months. And the reason behind this buzz is that we are enabling sustainable development to a continent where many people see a crisis. We see an opportunity to build and own clean energy infrastructure, which is going to power the biggest market of the 21st century. We do accept Bitcoin, and if anyone wants to send Bitcoin to that QR code, you will be invested in our company as quickly and as easily as our users invest in solar panels. I'm Abraham Cambridge, and this is the Sun Exchange. Thank you.